Am I starting? Am I recording? Jesus Christ. Alright. Hello. My name is Sickly Cyrus. Um, uh, fuck me. <laughs> Hi there. My name is Sickly Cyrus. I'm reacting today to, ah, this is really hard to do. I don't really do face cam because I don't have a fucking face. My name is Sickly Cyrus. I am reacting to my first album that I ever made to promote my second album that's coming out sometime in July. This album sucks. It's, it's not good, but it's it's me giving my honest opinion on what I feel that the album is. Like, I'm going to be rating each song, giving an average, all those fun things. So, let's see what happens. It's really weird having face cam because I don't do this shit. We're going to skip over the skits. I love the skits. Y'all can suck my dick. And we're just going to go straight into the first song ever, which is um, Sickly, featuring my homie dead poet, who's a good friend of mine. A little background to this one um this song is the first song i ever recorded under the sickly cyrus brand i recorded it in dead poet's basement way back before we had our own place this is what it sounds like i guess Fuck me, kill me, how you doing, little devil? Little missy thinks I'm sickly cause I dress up like a rebel Yeah, she missed me, wanna kiss me, but I'm below the surface level Now you new do wanna diss me, do me up with that you never Say she wanna fuck, so I took her to my devil's Then She told me to make it bleed like the ink out of my pen Scratches down my back, pretty much tattooed upon her thighs She asked me once to kill her, to at least look her in the eyes I don't wanna hurt you, baby, but I like the way you scream Lay it up on her neck, while my fingers trace along her seams Tearing at the fabric down, she thinks out of your fucking dreams only bring out every to the one from tearing through your screens Come here little bitch, I like the way you kiss me Come here little bitch, I like the way you miss me Come here little bitch, take that knife and try to stick me Come here little bitch, you're making me think sickly Look the devil in the eyes Beautiful suicide Yeah, so, that was sickly. Ah, face itchy. Y'all don't get to see this shit, though, because y'all don't need to know what I look like. Um, overall, the mixing on this song was not great. I literally just threw a distortion filter on it. The writing was fun. It was my first try at the full Dark Trap sound. So it wasn't, like, crazy good writing, crazy good flows. Same thing with Poet. It was fun. It was fun to make. So it was my first song on this thing. Same with Poet. It's like our first ever track. And you know what? I'm proud of it. I enjoyed it. It was very fun. Overall, I'd probably give this song uh, like a solid like six. Six out of ten for what I can do nowadays. Yeah, like I didn't know how to, I didn't know what panning was. Like, I, I knew what it was, sorry. I knew what panning was. I just didn't know how to do it <laughs> on my DAW. I do now, as you can tell, my new shit and with the new album coming out. But uh, I give this, yeah, six. Six out of ten. Uh, this next song is Overkill featuring Digress. And Digress is a, a musician that I, I really like. And I met him through TikTok. And he's a really cool dude. I like his music a lot. I asked him on a whim, not knowing if he'd say yes, but I asked him to be in one of my songs with me, which is like the third ever song I, I created, which is not good on my part, but he killed this shit. 
But uh, I'll, I'll just let it go. I really like this song and hopefully it translates over. Time, so I guess let's do the deal I know every rapper ever said that they gon' keep it real But most of it is bullshit So I guess I'll fucking keep it real It's always he said she said uh, Always wanna be a way uh, Smart so jank is a deep thing uh, Never understand how to be sick uh, Bitch, you're on my neck, that's a keep sick uh, Bitch, your favorite bitch, he said uh, I don't like you for the handshake uh, Nigga, like bitch, run like a good wish What gave your ass away? Where was my money? I didn't see my habitat. I need a summary of your little cat. Turn on the thumbs, I feel like a hermit man. I gotta change you know where are you at. I ain't no country man. I do not understand why you acting like you don't see the facts. Gonna make me act out. Gonna make me act out. Look at where we're at now. I lose my fucking mind. You're just a little scrap now. Bitch, I clean you up like a sham. Well, now, now. I bet that mouth doesn't move no more. Suck my dick, you stupid. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, your bitch got hit by Cupid. Yeah, I'm just vibing in this new shit. Now she wants the Cupid. Be slob on my Yo, digress, take this one. Yeah, I'm fucking paying because that shit is a job. Fuck a lover, boy. I'm just really trying to get fucked up. You don't like the way I'm moving, so bitch, tell me what you want. Be slob on my knob. I'm going on the cop. Yeah, I'm fucking paying because that shit is a job. Fuck a lover, boy. I'm just trying to really get fucked up. Uh, that was overkill. I really like that song. My verse is, you know, not great, but it's still enjoyable to my standard at least. I would enjoy a song that would sound like that. Lyrically wise, I tried some different flows. I enjoyed it. Could have been done better. Again, I didn't know what mixing was properly. I threw a distortion effect over it and called it a day. That's all I- uh, excuse me as I reach in my fucking eyeball. Itchy! I, I threw a distortion over it and called it a day. The end. Um, digress threw me one of my favorite verses I've ever heard from the guy on my shitty ass song so shout out to the boy digress do his homie absolutely great love his music i'd give that also a solid like six out of ten overall uh if it was just digress song i'd give it more but since i since my dumb ass is on it it is what it is but uh yeah so six out of ten hey corva uh we're gonna move on to the next one uh the next song is called lover boy and it is what it is Like it's taco, bring the thriller Say my name, I'll break the door I'm a demon, hear me roar You're the blood and I'm the spiller You're the roof and I'm the pillar Bitch, I ain't no lover, boy I don't fucking care with twists I'm a motherfucking killer Like it's taco, bring the thriller Say my name, I'll break the door I'm a demon, 
and like his cock will bring the thriller Say my name, I'll break the door I'm a demon, hear me roar You're the blood and I'm the spiller You're the roof and I'm the pillar So that was Lover Boy. That was my first try at funk. Uh, at first I really liked it. Uh, I don't really like it that much anymore. I don't know what the hell I was trying to do with the sickly cyber sinking samoids on a fucking sucker synergetic syllables sinking until the sun sets. None of that means anything. There's, it was literally, I was like, I'm gonna try alliteration. And I literally just spit random stuff and like it rhymed and that was barely anything at that point. My friends really like this song. I don't. Just in general, like the song's I, there's a little story elements to it for a reporter I was gonna have be part of the the lore, but I removed that fully. There's no reporter part of the lore anymore. Uh, my nose is itchy. Fuck me, bro. God damn it. I don't know what I was doing. It, it made no sense. Overall, I'll probably give that song a five, five out of ten. Like it was, it's enjoyable-ish. It's I. Right. But uh, we're gonna move on to Amosis now. The backstory behind this: uh, a homie in my town named Mediocre Main. Go follow him on Instagram. I'll put his link somewhere on here. I don't know where the fuck I'll put it, but I'll put it up. He's awesome. I had him on a song. I originally had him on a different song, but um, it just it wasn't working out for that one. So, but I still wanted him on this project. So awesome, Lingley, awesome Lingley. Fuck it, it's word now. I patented awesome Lingley. Lingley. He gave me a song of his own that he wasn't going to use anymore, and allowed me to put it on my album, make it my own by my own verse. But, uh, so that's that. We're going to do it now. I, I thoroughly kind of hate my part, but I really like the rest of the song. Um, so we'll see how that goes. Would you be offended if someone called you mediocre? We, we, we push back! Yeah, that's aim assist. Um, hey, this is my girl Corva. She's just coming to hang out. Hey, baby. That was aim assist. My vocals, uh, first time I ever tried like properly screaming, uh, that hurt to do and it was not very great. But the flows and stuff, pretty good. The bars themselves, also very good. I enjoy them. I think they're really nice, uh, really nicely written on my part. Shoving my finger in my eye again. Uh, I think they're really nicely written on my part. Uh, perform wise, not so much. But you know what? It was I. Mediocre main killed this shit. I fucking love his verse. It's so good. I'm so happy that he gave me this for my first album. Uh, I hope to work with him again in the future. It's a pretty good song. I give this um, probably around a 6 out of 10 as well. A solid 6. I give it that. Next is Tuco, which I fucking, you know, I love this song and my friends really like this song. I think it's really fun. It was like my first try uh, or second try at Boom Bap. I really enjoy the song, so I'm just gonna let it play and um, you all can shit on it all you want. I was five and he was six. We rode on horses made of sticks. He 
wore black and I wore white. He would always win the fight. Bang, bang. He shot me down. Bang, bang. I hit the ground. Bang, bang. That awful sound. That. Yeah, that was Tuco. I fucking love that song. I'm very proud of that. Flow-wise, shit hard. Bar-wise, shit's hard. Mixing-wise, nah. Again, I threw a fucking distortion over it and called it a day. I didn't pan nothing. They're all in the same bar. They're all level. They're all center. Every single bit of it. The screams, the ad-libs, the background, all of it. Makes it shit. But, everything else about it, performance-wise, like, all that shit about it, mmm. Love it so much. I would give it 8, but since it's, like, I didn't mix it the way I would want to, I'm going to give it a 7 for, like, for personally me a 7. 7 out of 10. That's what I'm calling this right there and then. Easy as that. Uh, the next, this is Brain Damage, another boom bap. This one was, like, my magnum opus almost for this album. Uh, it's one of my magnum opuses, at least. Uh, let's set the play.
it again. Blades flaying, blood raining, bodies hanging from the ceiling fan. Hit the slip ejector, flip a head of electric with the zipper running that for Bonnie Collar. Let's go out and do it again. Be the man from the lamp, but you don't got no bloody hands. Straight gloves, rich man. Never seen a single damn struggle on the streets. Smooth knuckles, hair sleek. Little Rosie on the cheek, ten grand one week. Damn. I'm the one that calls sickly. Everybody hates me, but they all still miss me. I'm the angel from 6th Street, they try to say I'm crazy, but I know they're just me Cause I'm a hot plate killer, kind of rise every single cut into your liver Slash, slash, thriller, my eyes will make you quiver Make your body shiver, leave you colder than ice when I throw you in the river I'm a functional murder addict who has a court for stopping teeth and heard it before But you never heard my reasons and you'll never get to hear me Said I'd be drowned up from the screaming, maybe I am crazy Or maybe I'm just damaged This headache feels like it's brain damage I need someone to help me pull me out this way That was Brain Damage. I love this song. Lyrically, flow-wise, love that shit. I think I did a great job with those. Uh, Mix-wise, I also, like, I didn't just do distortion. I added some, like, reverb here and there, a little bit of distortion here and there. But again, no panning, because I didn't know what the fuck I was doing. No compression, no fucking, no anything, no EQ. I didn't do shit on this one. Like, this album is fucking, there's no mixing. Like, it's pretty much raw vocals with some effects. There is no compression or anything on any of these. Because that's how bad I was in the beginning. It's how fucking unknowledgeable I was. But I give this an 8. Because this stands alone as a solid song that I would listen to and not be critiquing it the entire time. I thoroughly enjoy this track. So, 8 out of 10 for the song. 8 out of 10. Uh huh. Next is Loco Loco Loco. I made this song in 30 minutes. I came home feeling weird as hell. And I needed to make music that day real bad, but I had nothing written, like nothing at all. So I sat down, found a weird ass beat from a producer I've never heard of, who is now a good friend of mine, Orlov. He's great, incredible. This song popped off for no goddamn reason. Like it's done 1K on YouTube, 1K on YouTube music, and I don't know why. And it's like done like 700, 800, almost, almost a thousand on Spotify as well, which is weird. But uh, here's this weird piece of garbage. Hope you enjoy it. <laughs>
All right, so that was Loco Loco Loco. I freestyled that song in multiple takes, but freestyled it. Nothing was written down for that fucking piece of shit. Yeah, I, I don't know what to give that song in general. It's it's fun. It's mixed bad again. No panning, no compression, no nothing. Like, literally nothing. I just doubled my vocals on some things and made them higher than the rest. Nothing was really done. I, like, uh, I don't know what to do with that one. Because of how much it blew up, I'll give it a, like a 6. Like a 6 out of 10 for how, like, this was the start of my manic type period where, like, Holy Moly is a part of it, Die is a part of it, fucking a couple of songs in the album are part of it. You've heard my weird-ass manic, silly Cyrus style where it's weird as hell. That's, that's the, this was the start. This was the fucking father of it. 6, no, ah, 6. 6. I'm sticking with my first one. It's a 6 out of 10. Moving on to Die, I fucking love this song. Let's just give it a listen. Stand by for this message. A nuclear attack was commenced. 15 nuclear bombs have detonated in several areas across the country. All residents within a 400 mile radius of these areas. I hope you drown in a puddle. Hope you have a heart attack. I hope you get pushed by some rubble. Hope you fucking yeah. break your back. I hope yeah. you get fucking slashed. I hope you get in some trouble. I'm about yeah. to send you back. Cause I'm a piece of your demand. But it's so big like King Kong. You're a nigga look like it's fucking Kim Jong. You're a made up bitch. Yeah. While the rich get rich and lazy, we're all working here just slaving. So I guess I'm really craving a bloodthirsty lust. You know Cyrus got that riz, make your grandma come a shiz. What I do is none of your biz, shoot your shot before you miss. So go show this to your kids, or they must start acting violent. It's like playing GTA, cause real guns don't cause violence. Usurp the king, replace the water in his moat With the bodies of the people who decided we should choke On the air that we breathe, holy fuck is killing me I stop burning, I can't see, is this for what you want? Call me with precisely I If you do, prepare to fucking die Do not use your telephone. You know Cyrus got that riz, I'll make your grandma gum my shiz. Cyrus, 2023. Hardest bar ever said. No, but for real. <laughs> uh, I really like that song. I like it a lot. Again, no mixing at all. That shit was just raw as fuck because I didn't know what I was doing. And I didn't want to pay nobody because I was broke. Yeah, I still I am still broke. broke. I am broke back then as well. To I couldn't pay nobody, and I didn't have. I didn't learn. I didn't take the time to learn. I just wanted to make music, and I wanted to make it quick. Regardless of that, I really like this song. I like it a lot. So I'm giving it an eight out of ten. The flow is hard. The song is fun. The beat is hard. The bars are fun, and they're hard. I'm hard. Everything about this song is hard. I fucking love it. Fuck what anybody else says about it. They can't tell me nothing. I love the song. Die. I'm gonna perform the shit out of this song whenever I do shows because this would be a fun one for crowd work. But uh, yeah, 8 out of 10, keeping it at that. That shit slaps. It could be better with mixing, but that shit slaps. Next moment on the Goomy Face, let's just play it. I'm married to you. 
is the sis Cause I'm all your illnesses I can change the way that crowd used to win Have no witnesses No, that's for forgiveness Bitch, I'm way too fucking in the distance I can't play that with the band I'm down for the vicious This nickname is malicious Kate Cyrus for the feminists Buzz up through my head I'm in it Look, you're never listening Shaking from the insulin I'm choking on your illnesses Don't put up with no bullshit How about some more? Slice your gut up to a piss array of cooking like I struggle Make you cooking like you're mad at me Eat my stuff, I will invade Watch your words so best behave I'm sinking in the trenches, it's so hard I'm about to swatter I'm bringing hell with me, so you better see some shelter Chaos runs from my grounds, I'm a plan for my head I'm to the other grounds, it's nice and shit for bitch My kids will make you water One out of ten. One out of ten. That bar alone gives this song a one out of ten. I'm just gonna keep it going. Now she's all on top of me, trying to pay the top of me. Baby got a bag, mess and mix a lot of spot of me. She on my dick, look at that one. Suck on my blood, look at that one, bitch. Nobody like it, the way that I'm working, so mind you, fuck your business, bitch. Nobody wants to work for the kid. Nobody fucks with the way that we live. Nobody wants to hear my story, but here they are still listening. And you can't say shit, you a dumb ass bitch. I only feel bliss with a gun to the wrist. I'ma make a bitch bleed when I close my fist. Leaving lips, sticky stays on your face, no kiss. You can't say shit, you a dumb ass bitch. Okay, so before that bar, that song, hardest bars I've ever written up until that point. Performance wise could be better. Mix wise again could be so much better. But uh because of that bar, four. Th three out of ten. Three out of ten that song. Gumi Face is a three out of ten. Great beat. Incredible beat. Hard bars, but then that that one just face fuck a bitch. Like I gave her gutter tetany pretty hard unload in her eye gave her a million kid lobotomy not hard not hard at all anyways moving on to enamel my first ever released song let's give it a whirl shall we Tell the bitch to suck my dick, brass knuckles on my fist. I'ma tell you shit to piss. Tattoos on my wrist, cut the paint off on my shit. I'ma keep the rich, I'ma keep the poor, take a fuck a sip. Can't have a lactose, a factor in my area. Northern building, hang the killings, cause a slander, yeah. Fuck up on a bitch, pull it up on his shit. Pussy talk a shit, bitches wanna take the hit. Take a hit, use my shit, so take a minute. I don't got the drip, all my pockets full of lead. Bang the drum, make them numb, strong the lights, make them lit. Bitch, you bomb, make them dumb, toss a bullet in a mix. Him, I call it balance, running across the edges, say they use this waste of talent. Making music, starting at the base, and every bitch just wants a taste. Tugging out her lace, man, she says she fucking hates me, bitch, she wants me in her face. 
sin But I've got a clear conscience I can remember the exact day I lost it Voices trying to drown them out Hoping they don't make a sound Demons in my area I'm hoping they don't take it down Smoke in my lungs Not from the cigarette, a bitch on my tongue Not full of intellect, the chop will make them run Not talking about the gallon acts from the slum They stick it in your head Making everybody run Bum, biggie, bum Motherfucker say they hate me Now they really, really Song. Pussy on my dick, you better run, kitty, run Gonna blow the town, burn the city down, I can't come Bones on my teeth, burning through my enamel Rippers on my hip, I'ma slap you with a sandal Blow holes to your balls, let them make a candle Are you doing, motherfucker? I'ma turn you to a handful All you motherfuckers fakes, pull a chopper on your snakes Say the port of baggy, cause I ain't let you get away Fucker that you gotta say, on your knees, but don't you pray upon a Justin me or put a Jason, drop you in the lake Bitch, you come inside us in a body I'm not who I meant to be I know I'm not I should be dead Like I said I'm bad enough to run But these people in my life Keep me up when I'm down I just wish I could do better But instead I guess I'll drown I'm sorry to my family I know it's good to hear I just couldn't keep it an even though I had fears I'm a scared little boy, I'm scared of all his mind I don't know if I'll make it, but I promise I will try That was Enamel. Um, that was the first song I ever released. Um, looking back two years ago, this song was inspired by Witch House 40K. Uh, I really, really like it, uh, his style of music. And back then, he was him and Kamara were my like two only like intros to the genre. And I was like, I'm gonna try it out. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna see what I can do with this genre. And it came out with an animal. Bar wise, it's pretty good. Mix wise, I just threw distortion on it again. But I tried a little. I tried pretty hard for this one. Yeah, I don't know what to say about that one. Uh, there's a lot of slang in there that I didn't. I don't use. Like I've never said yappa in my life. <laughs> never once have I ever said yappa. But again, I was using an. Inf I was you know using influence and um and all that shit from other artists. I didn't know what I was at that point yet. Uh, again, first song I ever released. Yeah, so uh, I was 23 when I made that. I'm 25 now. Uh, and it's alright. I'm gonna give it a five. Five out of ten. That's alright. It's pretty chill. I know. I know a few friends of mine are gonna yell at me for that. They're gonna send me a text the second they see this part of the video, and they're gonna be mad. But uh, <laughs> regardless, uh, yeah, four. Or five. What did I say? I think I said five. Whatever. It's there. Uh, next is Black Canary, which is like my ending of the album. This I thought this is my magnum opus. This is the hardest I've ever went. This is the craziest song I ever made. This will blow me up. It did not. Let's just play it. Let's see how it goes. You happy punching the bag, or you want to go a few rounds with me? Little did they know that they're making so, so very light. I'm gonna eat them up and spit them 
So that was Black Canary. That track I had a ton of fun with, performance-wise, bars-wise, that shit hits hard. I like that song a lot. Again, mixing-wise, not the best. It was no panning, no compression, no nothing. This had barely even any reverb or anything on it. I think it was just like almost totally raw. Uh, this is like my first go at like screaming for bars, like doing like actual like scream vocals. Um, and it was okay, it was a good start. Wasn't the best, was a good start. I'm overall gonna give that song a, like a 7 out of 10. Yeah. 7 out of 10. 6. 7. 7 out of 10. 7 out of 10. Well, that was my album, um, Music to Fist Fight Satan 2. My first edition into this um, amalgamation that I'm making. And I want to say it was, a, it was a good first album. It was better than what I imagined my first album was going to be in this style. It's been a little, it was a lot of fun to make. It took me a while, a lot of beats, a lot of people, uh, I met a lot of people through this. This was the kickstart into what I can do now, and I am very proud of what I can do now. This really shot me into the underground community that I'm now in, and it was a lot of fun. I had a great time doing it. My final overall rating for this album is going to be... 6.5. Yeah. Yeah. I give this a 6.5 out of 10. A lot of cool things here, but it still leaves a lot out in the open. Like it leaves, it leaves spaces where it shouldn't. Uh, a lot of fun though. Yeah. So music fist fights, music to fist fight Satan to 6.5 out of 10. By yours truly, Sickly Cyrus, the guy who made the album. But uh, that being said, I have an album coming out in July. At least I hope it'll be July, but it's coming out in July. And it is called Music to Fist Fight God 2. It is going to be... It's going to be something. I've worked very hard on this. Like, very hard on this. I've spent a lot of money and time in this. And I couldn't be happier with a lot of the tracks. A lot of things had to get switched around here and there. But I am very, very proud of what it is. Um, but yeah, July sometime. It'll be coming out, so keep your eyes out. Go to my Instagram, at uh, Sickly Cyrus. That's my Instagram. That's where I do all my promo stuff and everything else. Sometimes I do it on TikTok, which is also at Sickly Cyrus. I don't really go in there that much because that place is a fucking cesspool. But, uh, yeah. you see the updates, everything on Instagram. Um, maybe I'll do another rating of my, uh, my album when I release my other ones. Maybe I'll rate my EPs if y'all want me to. Go through all those and shit on them <laughs> but uh yeah thanks for tuning in and watching this shitty ass fucking review uh and uh i really hope you guys enjoy it check out my instagram sickly cyrus on all platforms soundcloud fucking spotify apple music deezer fucking title whatever y'all have i don't care go listen if you don't want to whatever you think you hate it fuck it who gives a shit yeah Hope you enjoy. I don't know how to. I don't know how to outro a fucking video. I'm probably just gonna cut it out mid sentence or some shit.